Hey everyone, Justin here from the Hang Fire Podcast. Well, today is another big day because the Stones released their second single from the new album, Hackney Diamonds. The song, Sweet Sounds of Heaven, just dropped this morning. And from what I can tell, it's going to be quite a huge track. I say that because I haven't heard the track yet. I know, I know. But I've decided I'm done listening to any more new songs from the album until the album is in my hands on October 20th. Um, I would like to save something for the big day. And um, I suspect that this song would be quite a huge moment for the album and from the reviews coming in it seems like it is so I would like to save it for the album that's just me though um, but I hope everyone else is listening and enjoying the song because it seems like it's a huge deal Lady Gaga apparently sounds great on it Stevie Wonder is also on the track and so just that combination alone is very unique and very one of a kind so um, it's a very special moment and from what I can tell from the reviews coming in and people's reactions is that the song is um, hearkening back to uh, an exile vibe or perhaps a tattoo you vibe. Um, again, these are all just, you know, it's whetting my appetite. I wish I could listen. Who knows if I'll break. Maybe I will in the next few days. But I'm determined to stay strong and not listen to the song until I get the whole album at this point, which is just a few weeks away. So anyway, so a uh, big day. I uh, hope everyone is uh, enjoying the song and also the great artwork that comes with the single. The new single is also adorned with fantastic artwork by Paulina Almira, who did the rest of the Hackney Diamonds artwork. A beautiful image on the front cover of the single, which I love. Might be my favorite image of the whole series of artwork from the album. On the streaming services, at least on Spotify, I was able to see that there are two versions on the single release. There is the edited five minute version and also the fuller seven plus minute version. Uh, I figured that this song would be quite an epic and it's turning out to be just that. What I'm hearing and seeing in the reviews coming in, people are really going nuts over this track, and which is great. It sounds like it's going to be fantastic and it sounds like it is fantastic. Um, I just want to save something for the album. So I hope everyone is listening to the new song. Let me know in the comments below if I should break my uh, fast and not listen to the song because um, if it's that good, maybe I'll listen to it. So let me know in the comments below if it's something that I should uh, break my promise for. Also check out on the Stone social media, they put up a fantastic little teaser for the song, which you know is still valuable because it has fantastic images of Polaroid shots that were taken during the sessions of the recording of the album, which were taken by Andrew Watt. A fantastic series of pictures. You, you kind of have to pause the video to kind of catch all of them, but there's some amazing moments. I'll try to post some that I was able to capture here, but um, some great shots of the band working and hanging out at the studio, which is very special. You don't get to see uh, that view too often. One other news update is that the Stones announced earlier this week that they are working with Major League Baseball to put out a series of very special edition vinyl album covers of Hackney Diamonds. They're going to be putting out a bunch of covers based on different team colors. So if that's your thing, that's going to be available as well. So um, many options to get Hackney Diamonds if you're up for it. Colored vinyl and now special covers. I mean, you have a lot to choose from. Um, last thing before we go, one housekeeping update. I finally put up episode two of the podcast, which is on Spotify and Apple and Google Podcasts as well as Amazon. But in case you forgot, uh, the content on the podcast is completely different from the content that is on here on YouTube. As you can guess, the content here on YouTube is primarily video based and the content on the podcast is your more traditional podcast audio only um, content, which is completely separate. It's two different um vibes and two different content altogether. It took me a while to get a follow-up to episode one, but I finally put up episode two, a profile on Keith Richards just the other day. So I hope it's something that you enjoy. Anyway, that's all I have for right now. Let me know what you think of the new song. Very big day. I won't be listening today, but I'll be reading the comments. Anyway, uh, talk to you later. Thanks for watching Hangfire.